Hello, welcome to the very first virtual hobby day by the Port Aransas Parks and Recreation Department. Today we have Norma Peters who has lots of hobbies and makes, creates all kinds of fun stuff. Today she will make a red net drinking glass that she showed at our we're having fun activity this week in case you missed it. So, go ahead, Norma. Okay, good morning. And today we're going to make our drinking glass, redneck drinking glass. And to do the redneck drinking glass, it's very simple and people really enjoy decorating them. So, what I'm going to do is take a candlestick and of course a redneck tumbler and I'm going to put some glue on the tumbler. This is very difficult, you know, but we'll, <laughs> we'll do it. And you just put the glue on the tumbler. And what kind of glue? Uh, this is uh, E6000 and it's pretty strong. So you put the candlestick right in the center of the glass so that you can get it even and then for another part of it and by the way we have Rudolph watching today because he's going to be part of the classes one of the next weeks very simple but kind of cute anyway uh, what we're doing with the glass today they like to add a little bit more redneck stuff and so for redneck thing today I have turquoise made out of potatoes from jewelry and we're going to put that on the redneck glass and that will make it even more redneck than it was. So to do that we just put some glue around the edges and very simple. Then we just uh, put the turquoise potato candy or jewelry you put that on there and that adds a little bit more redneck stuff when anybody asks you what you got on there for decorations turquoise yeah made out of made out of potatoes so we're going to have a class on making jewelry with this too with jewels and it's very interesting so, if you get the idea, that's what we do with this. How did you make the potato beads? The potato, uh, you take a, a potato and cut it in small pieces, and then you put it on a cute skewer stick to make the hole in it, and just set it outside, and the good Lord helps us get it dry. So, and when it's dry, then you bring it in, and... and uh, get some turquoise paint and then just paint it and you have it just like this. So this is what it looks like when you get finished. You'll have your turquoise potato stuff and your redneck glass. You'll have a lot of fun with those. And that's what we're doing for that. And like I said, we're going to have a class on Rudolph. We'll have a class on making the turquoise candy or the, the decorated the jewels and then also I make t-shirts you just uh, have to bring your t-shirt and uh, I'll show you how to cut it we have the beads supplied and you sew them on with the jewelry elastic stuff so they don't come off and anyway if they're a lot of fun to do and all we ask is you bring one of your own t-shirts and We'll help you get it decorated and it'll be fun. So we had a lot of fun with those classes and hope you go down to Parks and Recreation and sign up. We'd love to have you come. Thank you. Thank you, Norma. I just want to remind everybody that you need to go to portarecdesk.com to register for any of our programs. We will be having Hobby Days on Friday 11 on Facebook and then YouTube. We will also be having our We're Having Fun 
every Wednesday at one o'clock. The we're having fun is first come first. I mean, is registration limited to ten? We're very safe, and um, it'll be at one o'clock at the Porter Renzis Community Theater. On behalf of the Parks and Rec Department, I thank you.